Right, now then, uh, I don't know if you've been watching the television lately, but Princess Cruises have got a brand new commercial. Um, let's have a look at it and see if we can remind you of it. It's so easy to lose perspective, and sometimes we just don't take time to enjoy each other's company because we're always working, or there's something going on that gets in the way. We start looking at our, our own work-life balance and, and trying to get it balancing more in favour of, of the life parts. It's given us the opportunity to just be a couple again. No responsibilities, it's just us. As well as seeing these great places and having these amazing experiences, we're also learning new things and picking up something new every day. It's injecting a bit more fun and, and laughter back into the relationship. It's like having the old Joe and Richard back. Look good, did Look good, didn't it? Um, listen, now, the couple that you saw there have joined us. It's Richard and Joe. Uh, thanks very much for being here. Lovely. Okay. I mean, come, they've come all this way. Look, 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 look at them there, <laughs> look at them now. I mean, yeah, look at them there, look at them. I know, yeah. Guys. Autographs later. <laughs> uh, so it was your very first cruise, wasn't it? Was? It? it was your very first cruise. Um, and it must have been like me because you know I go on a cruise and I've got this like film crew following me around. And like, go away, leave me. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? What was it like on, on the ship itself? You know, your very first cruise. Um, was it what you were expecting? I think we went with an open mind, but I think you you are slightly you do have a slight preconception, don't you? So no, I think it was a really pleasant surprise for us. Like I say we went open minded, but not expecting to have the greatest holiday just to have a good time perhaps you know but we came away and, and we were completely converted weren't we it, it really was I think it absolutely than blew away my expectations yeah. I think it was just for us uh, one of the best holidays we've ever had just for the sheer amount of things that you get to do and experience so was, uh, what was what was the main differences to what you you know I, I know from when, before I went cruising all the things I thought about it what was the main difference for when you got on a cruise I didn't think it'd be like this what was the sort of main thing for me, I think it was the, the flexibility. I think you have this preconception in your head that you're going to have to dine at a set time, you're going to have to wear specific items of clothing at different times, and that's not really how we, we run our life. And I think the flexibility, you can eat when you want, drink when you want, go out when you want, go on an excursion, yeah. don't go on an excursion, go to the gym if you want, don't go to the gym. It is just, it, it was flexibility. It was incredible. Um. We talk about the food there. How did you find the food? Yeah, it was amazing. Wasn't it? We were really, really surprised. I think we spent a majority of time just went to the Horizon buffet and it just had everything you could possibly want there. So and the best pizza at sea. So he was happy. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Yeah. Pizza all the time. I was time. supposed to be eating unlimited healthy pizza. salad, but yeah, <laughs> unlimited pizzas are not a good thing when you're <laughs> away there. But yeah, it did. The food was excellent. As good as any. Hotel we've ever I, seen. I was, it, I, I, I was amazed. It was uh, particularly the buffets. You want to say, oh, buffets. Um, yeah. But uh, the, the, so the amount of people that are catering for you, you don't know how they can keep it all so fresh and hot and as nice as it was. And but, uh, virtually yeah. 24 hours a day if you want to graze const constantly, yeah. you can, can't you? Yeah. But, uh, yeah, food is fabulous. What did you think of the entertainment? We um, saw a comedian. Yeah. We went to a show. Mm. Uh, we, on top of that, we did bingo. We went to quizzes, so uh, which again we wouldn't normally do in our outside yeah. life, but to do it on on board the ship was uh, brilliant. Now we, we we saw you going on a few excursions there as well. Yes. Now one thing I want to ask you about: they got me onto a bicycle once uh, <laughs> uh, to, to do some filming. I remember that. I, I, I saw the two of you. There they are going down the hill on a bike. <laughs> we all go downhill on bike. Yeah, yeah. But we had to get up there first. Did, did, they, go, did they take you up? Did they take you up? Yes. No, we cycled. Well, they, they drove us a certain way up, but we did cycle a lot. And there's more than one take on that, so we were doing it half a dozen times, and up and down. And this is this is the Mediterranean, so it was also incredibly humid. So uh, yeah. it was and it wasn't a private road, so you'd be halfway through, sort of traipsing the way up, and now suddenly there's a car coming. Stop, oh, yeah. cut, back down, and you don't even do it again. So. I thought we were quite fit until that day, and then I was just, yeah. Oh, it was hot, and it was really humid, wasn't it? Yeah. Fit to drop. Yeah. Fit to drop. <laughs> <laughs> now, 
for anyone who has never been on a cruise holiday, they're, they're sitting there at home now thinking, yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Um, you know, what would you say? I would I just don't hesitate. Don't hesitate to do mm. it because it, well, we can only go off our experience. We were exactly those people. We were the ones sat at home going, oh, because we've, we've talked about it for years. Our friends are all cruisers and it's just something we, maybe next year, maybe next year. So don't wait. Get on one. Try it for yourself. And hopefully you'll have as great a time as we did. One question I'd like to ask. Um, was it full of posh people who you wouldn't get along with? <laughs> um, <laughs> there was such a mix of people. <laughs> Um, and I, I genuinely believe if you go on with an open mind and immerse yourself in, there are some incredible characters on board a ship. And if you go fully open to it, um, there's, there are posh people. There are also people walking around in Bermuda shorts 24 hours a day. So it's, it's just a whole myriad of different people, which uh, for us just made it a great experience. And just one final question before we go into a cruise, a, a princess cruise, which is absolutely whew, humdinger of a deal. Um, Compared to what you'd normally pay to go on a you know your normal land-based holiday, the value for money. You know when you go home and you consider you know what I got for what I paid. What did you think? He's a money man. Yeah, we we were really really surprised. I think as you say, when when you package everything together with your flight, you fly to Rome, and then you've got seven days, all your food, everything that you're doing, all your excursions, and everything. It it comes in considerably cheaper than us going to Cyprus for a week and sitting in a, a you know a, a beach resort somewhere. And particularly yeah. on the Emerald because you can get your drinks package as well before you go. That's a massive part of it so you know exactly what you're paying and it's yeah. it's all there yeah. and then you can just drink the night away every day if you want and, <laughs> in crooners. <laughs> these are people oh in crooners these are people after my own heart. After my own heart. I'll see you in crooners soon. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we loved it there. Yeah, yeah. I'll tell you what talking of the Emma Princess we've got a lovely lovely ship uh, a lovely uh, cruise now it's going to be it's going to be great let's have a look on board shall we and see what it's all about and here she is absolutely stunning absolutely stunning this is the sort of thing that you can expect on yours. And you see what was it? It's just people like us yes. enjoying themselves. Like us.